banks of the Kishwaukee River. We're in DeKalb, Illinois, where the crowd is pumped up for this exciting college football matchup. This coin toss presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. We'll see how these two teams play in this game as they prepare for the opening kickoff. Sends it sailing downfield. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. The golden flash and their ground game's always been sensational. It's not always one guy, Herbie. Sometimes they've got two or three that can carry the load. And that's what makes it so tough for this defense is you're not focusing in on just one guy. You're focusing in on really an entire scheme. And because of that diversity, I think it makes it more of a challenge. And you got to be better tacklers in the open field. And, and I think that's really what they've stressed all week is tackling and gang tackling and getting to the football. Hard to get to guys and make tackles in space. So the sack makes this a second and long. Up the middle for a nice game. That's a game of five on the play. That brings up third and twelve. Strike complete. He's down. There's nothing better for a defense's mindset than to get a three and out. I mean, a turnover, of course, is a positive play, and a coach will take that any day of the week. But to know you've stopped the best their offense has to offer for three straight plays, that's a confidence builder. Like a couple of boxers in round one, these two teams are feeling each other out. Boy, the crowd was loud and did their part. Now if they're able to move the ball downfield, they can take control of this game early. So let's see what the offense can do as they come out onto the field. And he carries the ball for a nice game. So the old draw play gets him a good seven yards. goes at the 42 yard line when you're running the ball for big chunks of yards like that you've got something working and he's taken down around the 32 yard line it up the middle for a nice run so he picked up a few on that run yeah he did a nice job of using his blockers on that run really a nice read and he's tackled after positive yardage First down. Ready, check, check. Eagle. Fires out to his receiver. Tackle right around the six yard line. one-yard drive and they come away with a touchdown so our score 7-0 Northern Illinois is lining up to kick this one off from his own goal line he's to the 20 he makes it to the 25-yard line 
Northern Illinois is looking right now like they've got all three phases working for them so far, Kirk. Yep, it's early, but they are in control of this game. The defense is, seems to have a very good feel for what they're doing out there. The offense moved the ball down the field. Special teams, everything right now is really in sync for this game. You never like to have to play from behind, but a deficit this manageable shouldn't be in the front of their minds. They just need to go out there and play. Here's a quick throw. Complete. He's got room. And they make the stop at the 42. What a great time to go with the play action. The defense was anticipating run. They came up to stop the ball carrier. The quarterback was able to find his receiver downfield. He makes a big-time play and a great catch for a first down. And the big pickup through the air has made it first and ten. Tackled after decent pickup. Gaining four yards. That makes it second and six. Takes a handoff, tackled for a loss. Third down, and they need to get it down to the 32. Big kick here to try to pin the offense deep in their own territory. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. So it's time to see this offense go to work again. This defense couldn't stop them from moving the ball and inevitably finding the end zone. The quarterback in the gun, empty backfield, five wide receivers in the formation. Throws a strike over the middle. He's tackled at the 29-yard line. They come out in a five-wide set. He's scrambling. They'll bring him down at the 34. Northern Illinois is up by a touchdown. He's under pressure. Throws out and a leaping interception by the corner. At the 30, to the 20. And that was just an outstanding pick. Great play by the defender to high point the ball, but the quarterback wasn't in rhythm on the throw. It's first and ten. Ball on the 13-yard line. Catches it, and that's all. He ran a good-looking route and picked up positive yardage. That he did, and he made a good catch. That short passing game is where you see all those hours in the summer that you put in pay off. Here's the give. Tackle made right around the four-yard line. The back gets three on the carry. Short yardage situation here. It's third and one. And he's level at the two-yard line. That's a gain of two on the play. That makes it first and goal. So at the end of one, Northern Illinois leads 7 nothing. Welcome back here. We resume action now here in the second quarter.
That brings up a second and goal. Six yards to the end zone. And they get nice yardage on that one. able to run it in. I'll tell you what, when you're a quarterback and the goal line is right there, it's pretty hard to pitch the ball when you think you can get in. That's a smart decision to keep it for the score. Here's the PAT to tie this thing up. And he hits the PAT. A six-play, 13-yard drive, and they come away with seven points. And Brad, right now, the offensive line just winning the battle in the trenches, opening up some big running lanes. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. He'll take it from the two. Brought down at the 26-yard line. The offense comes out to start this drive, and they're hoping for a better result as they threw a pick on their last possession. The first rule on offense is to take care of the football. These guys need to remember that on this drive. And he's tackled around the 28-yard line. This is going to be a first down. He's taken down around the 42-yard line. He's going to try and scramble. He gets hit out of bounds at the 46-yard line. Scrambled. Now he's going to run and watch out. He's at the 40. And down he goes at the 39. Makes it to the 31. That's good for a gain of eight yards. That makes it second and two. So an empty backfield with five wide receivers. Scrambling around. And he's taken down at the 24. From the 24-yard line. First down. Tackle after a decent run up the gut. seven-yard line. They bring him down in the backfield. It was the defensive lineman that got a hold of him there. You're not going to break many tackles when this guy gets his hands on you. That brings him second and goal. Here's play number 10 on the drive. Quick strike and it's caught for the touchdown. And a nice catch by the receiver for the touchdown. Anytime you're near the red zone, you got to keep an eye for this guy. They love going to him down here. on the extra point. A nice 10 play, 72 yard drive, and they get it in for seven. Boy, this offense right now is just being physical, really controlling the line of scrimmage, and it's opening up some nice big lanes for the running back. So the score now, 14-7. Taken at the five. Gets to about the 24 yard line. 
In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. Here he goes. Gains his way to the 39-yard line. So he keeps it, and he gets a big first down. The quarterback made a very good decision here not to pitch. He saw a break in the defense and just hit it for a big game. From their own 39-yard line, it's first down. Play action, good for about four yards. Game of four on the play. That makes it second and six. Kent State just took their first time out. Gains his way to the 46-yard line. From the 46 yard line, first down. They go back to him on a quick throw, and he hits him hard at the 40 yard line. Good for a gain of six yards. That'll make it second and four. Knocked down immediately after the catch. That's a gain of 14 yards on the play. First and 10. All on the 26 yard line. That's a great tackle at the 20. Gain of six yards. That'll make it second and four. on that one. Well, I didn't think they did a very good job of selling the pass. The defense was able to read the play and come right in there and make a nice stop. Quick throw to the tight end. He's tackled in the open field. First down. Out quickly to the tailback. Brought down in the open field. Fires in there, got it. Touchdown. And did that play ever develop nicely? Well, it's all about the receiver on this play. He beat his man off the line and then ran a perfect route. All he had to do after that was make the catch. They got great concentration from everyone to connect on that flag pattern. We'll be tied with the extra point. He makes the PAT. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. He just drills this one. He's to the 20. And he's tackled at the 26. Boy, the two offensive coordinators have to be loving this. In fact, you can look over at our booth next to us and see how much they're enjoying it with a big smile on their face. The defensive coordinators, on the other hand, might be looking for a pink slip on Monday. So their last drive resulted in six points. Do you think we'll see the same result on this one? They ran the ball extremely well on their last drive. And until this defense figures out how to stop it, I think they'll have no problem moving the ball down the field. Brought down at the 41-yard line. He made a real nice play on that one. I'll tell you what, in today's game, you have to have the ability to run the football. Give the quarterback a lot of credit. He made a great play and really gave his team a boost. Makes the catch and look out. Tackle right around the 48-yard line. They get a good seven yards on that one. Good decision here. Nice dump off. It's only seven yards, but the offense will take that play every time. One more play now before we hit halftime, so they'll most likely throw one towards the end zone here. 
Throws it to the outside. Couldn't haul it in. So at the end of the half, 14 apiece. Glad to have you with us in the studio for the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Reese Davis and David Pollock here completely locked in on that first half. What a terrific first half. This is everything we anticipated this game being. And we're going to be riveted to this game, I feel like, David, in the second half, anticipating a terrific finish. It's it's fun. It's 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 living up to the hype every single time. We can't even turn the channel here. We got it on the big screen, on the big 60-inch. Yes, it's quite nice, by the way, too. The weather's nice and warm. It's beautiful. Got some chips. We're opening them up a little bit. But great game, living up to the hype. It definitely feels like both teams are evenly matched. It feels like it can go either way. It feels like it's going to come down to the wire. And the only thing I hope it doesn't come down to is a kicker. Please don't come down to a kick in the end. Both these teams playing great D, playing great O, you know, physical, you know, pounding on each other, making big plays. Don't come down to a finesse kick by like a, a soccer player, please. David and I will be keeping an eye on your game and everything else going on in the country here in our palatial and comfortable surroundings in the studio. The best seat in the house belongs to Brad Nessler in Kirk Herb Street. And we welcome you back to the action here, just about set for the second half. He's to the 20. He makes it out to maybe the 23-yard line. Time's getting a little bit tighter now. You gotta make every possession count. Gets out to around the 32. Makes it to the 41. He's knocked out of bounds around the 46 yard line. him out right around the 32 yard line. He gets rid of this one. From the 32 yard line, it's second down. the stop at the 18. He's at the 20. That makes it first and 10. Now he's scrambling. He's tackled at about the 17-yard line. Pushed out of bounds, setting up a first and goal. Touchdown, Huskies! the extra point. Northern Illinois is
He's lining up to kick this one off. It's fielded at the two. He's tackled at the 28-yard line. There's still plenty of time to keep running their offense as usual here. I don't think they need to feel any anxiety about trailing. Oh, boy, almost intercepted. Hey, that's a heads-up play there by the defender. Get those hands up and something good may just happen. From their own 28-yard line, second down. Throws a bullet over the middle. They'll bring him down right around the 40. Number 28 makes the tackle at the 40-yard line. First down. Fires quick. Tipped. Surprising to me that the secondary was in such good position. I thought the play call had him fooled at first, but a nice play by the D. From their own 40-yard line, it's second down. Throws it in a hurry. Good tackle there in space. Makes the reception. Number 21 makes the tackle at the 50-yard line. First down. And they got to him before he could get back to the line. From their own 48-yard line, second down, five wide. Tackle made at the 40. Number 28 on the tackle at the 40-yard line. Looks left, intercepted. Well, he was facing a big pass rush. The ball had no chance of being caught by one of his teammates. That's what pressure will do for any defense. From their own 49-yard line, first down, Northern Illinois, up seven points. Gets to around the 42. That brings in second and nine. Got some open field. Nice run to the outside. it to the 27. Makes his way out to about the 15. Tackles him for a loss. That is a loss of four yards. That makes it second and 14. From the 19 yard line, second down. And he's tackled after positive yardage. Pitches back. Touchdown, NIU.
And he converts the extra point. They line up to kick this one away. He's to the 20. And he just got drilled. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. And he throws it away. From their own 23-yard line, it's second down. Up to his receiver, and he's tackled at the 33. A quarterback in the gun with five receivers. Slings it. And he's shoved out of bounds at the 49. When you can move the ball downfield in big chunks like that, you've got the defense right where you want them. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 49. Stop behind the line. That's three down and one to go. Northern Illinois is in front by 14. Back in this very pivotal fourth quarter. They come out on an empty backfield. Quick throw, and down he goes. Right around the 44-yard line. He made a good read here to find his teammate. That's sound decision-making. From the 44-yard line, third down. Complete, and he's out of bounds. The defense might need to make some changes to their coverage scheme because that was just too easy. And a quick throw. He's at the 20, and he's taken down at the 18-yard line. It's a great job here by the quarterback of recognizing the outside linebacker blitz and delivering the football for a first down. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 18. Big opening. Nice run there as they work the outside. That's a gain of five on the play. That brings him And this is the ninth play of the current drive. They give to the tailback. He's pushed out of bounds around the nine yard line. Third down again. He's taken down right around the six yard line. This is the 11th play of this drive. When you feel pressure like that, the worst thing you want to do is just to throw the ball into coverage. He got away with one right there. He's very fortunate. Next time, he should just throw it away out of bounds. Gets to about the five-yard line. Thirteenth play of the drive coming up. Gets 
gets it out to his receiver in a hurry. And he's hit immediately. That's good for a of two yards. It's do or die time right here. Fourth and goal from the three. Just under three to go in regulation. Steps out of bounds at the one. Both teams are well aware that a score on this drive is going to create an almost insurmountable lead. This defense has really got to step it up and make a stop. He's to the 10, and he tackles him hard at the 16. First and 10, ball on their own 16. gets out to about the 18-yard line. A yard, maybe two on the carry. The Golden Flash will use their first time out of the half. Here we go. Right in. Right in. And they get nice yardage on that run. Kent State's going to have to use their second time out of the half. Short yardage situation here. It's third and one. his man first down he's to the 40 and he was that close to turning that into a big play this guy is so versatile you can use him at the line as an extra blocker or send him downfield like another wide receiver either way he's a great resource on every down he gets to about the 31 yard line the 31-yard line. It's first down. He fights forward to about the 30. Call it a gain of one yard. That makes it second and 10. We have less than a minute to go. Nice run up the middle. They're about four yards away here on third down. And that should do it. Our final tally in this one. 28-14, Husky. That's going to do it for this presentation of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk Street, this is Brad Nessler saying goodbye.